You know, looking back on my trajectory of, you know, in the UFC, coming to become a world champion, I've always was focused on being the best in the world, and I was able to attain that with hard work, dedication, and a lot of sacrifice. You know, I, you know, shot into the UFC and you know became world champion at a young age, and I lost at a young age, but that allowed me to grow in those years of a lot of downtime, you know, injuries, you know, self doubt, you know, getting away from who I was, and. Uh, you have to dig deep. That's where you really tru truly find out who you are when you're at the bottom. Body late in the round. Oh! 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 Cody No Love is back! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I don't Joke. think there's a man faster in the sport. You know, I was getting ready to fight for the world title again. You know, I worked, worked so hard to get there, battled through hell and back. And I got COVID, got COVID pretty bad, had a lot of, you know, residual effects, vertigo, blood clots. Um, pneumonia, I had it all, it was really bad. I had it for like four or five months, I was testing positive for it. I always took it serious, but I felt like if I ever got it, I was like, I'm young, I'm healthy, and I'll, you know, I take care of my body, but it definitely did uh, take a toll on me. You know, it took me a while, it took me about like, you know, about half the year to start feeling like myself again. How about now? I feel great. Yeah, I mean, I, this is the best camp I've had, the hardest I've pushed probably in my career. You get an opportunity, it has to be met with preparation, and that's what we were able to do this last eight to ten weeks, and uh, we're ready to go out there and, and capitalize on this opportunity. Official weight, 135 and a half pounds for Cody Garbrandt. I'm ready to go. I'm ready for uh, a battle. You know, I'm not taking him lightly. I'm taking him like he's the best fighter in the world, and this is the biggest fight of my life, so. The biggest fight is the one in front of you, and it's Rob Font.